Uh, there's another uh, cleaning method that they do in Sweden that's called Swedish death cleaning. It's a real thing. There's a book. Look it up. Now, the premise behind Swedish death cleaning is you're supposed to get rid of all your clutter before you die so you don't burden your family and your loved ones with all your stuff, right? So I've decided I am not doing it. I have cleaned up after these people for too many years. <laughs> not. I'm not cleaning on my deathbed. I'm not going to do it. So before I die, I'm going to buy a giant warehouse and I'm going to fill it with dirty laundry. Just stinky socks and watered up underwear and wet towels. And then in all the dirty laundry, I'm going to hide cash money. So they have to go through all the laundry to find the money. And occasionally, I'm just going to put a note in there that says, see, ha ha, ha ha, isn't this fun? You should have picked up your socks. Exactly. Swedish death cleaning. So I had to get my passport renewed recently. I, I went to Walgreens to get my passport photo taken. You can get them done at Walgreens. Walked in there, and I told the guy behind the counter, I kind of get my passport photo done. And he was like, oh, okay. Like, he was so annoyed. He had just taken the job to sell toothpaste, and now they're making him run the Sears Portrait Studio, right? <laughs> so I walked over there, and he started to count. One, two, three. And then I did what I've done my whole life. If somebody counts and holds a camera up, I smiled. And he went, no, you can't smile. It's a passport photo. has to be a neutral expression. I said, hey, I'm a smiley person. This is my neutral. See, I'm happy. I'm sad. <laughs> I'm terrified. <laughs> I hate you. I am a Southern woman, and they are all the same. <laughs> I'm Karen Morgan. Thank you all so much for having me. Have a great night. Wonderful as always. Great to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Karen Morgan, everyone. KarenMorgan.com.